It has been more than a year since Nevada State Trooper Micah May lost his life in the line of duty, but the community is still coming together to honor his true sacrifice. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Denise Feldes. And I'm Brian Loftus. This time he's being recognized at a national level in the 2023 Rose Bowl Parade. Sasha Loftus spoke with his family tonight. He joins us now live. Sasha with more. Denise and Brian, you'll remember Trooper Micah May was hit and killed during a car chase here on the I-15 last year. It was a dark day for our community, but tonight's event was about finding hope after tragedy. We honor you, uh, Micah. The ultimate honor after the ultimate sacrifice. It really means a lot that he's still being remembered. More than a year after he died while in the line of duty. Nevada State Police Trooper Micah May will soon be recognized at a national level in the 2023 Rose Bowl Parade. As we remember Micah May. On Thursday, friends and family joined May's wife Joanna to see his part of the Donate Life Float and get it ready for the big day. So I really hope he understands how much he meant to us and the community. Trooper May, who was an organ donor, will represent the entire state of Nevada with this florograph. Truly um, the epitome of being a hero, uh, not only that day, but again throughout his whole entire career. Stephen Peralta of Nevada Donor Network says they chose May for his extraordinary bravery on the day he was hit and killed during a car chase in July of 2021. But when you look at that day and what had happened um, and you look at the incident that led up to it and his ultimate sacrifice. Joanna says she's thankful to see the community's efforts for her late husband. What he did was truly scary. And she wants him to know how much his service still means. I really hope he's smiling down. Now, Trooper May's family was able to finish the, his face in that florograph, specifically his eyebrows. They were able to take part in that. And if you'd like to see that florograph in that float, it'll again be in the Rose Day Parade on January 2nd of 2023. Reporting live tonight, Sasha Loftus, 8 News Now.